about the 68 yard touchdown run? How did that come about? Um, well, basically, coach called it. It was a good decision. Coach made the play. Um, we was really paying attention to the end, and he was like, he was like trying to confuse me. So basically, like one play, he just took the running back, and I just did what I had to do. The defensive end. Defensive end. Yeah. He was pitching in that play, mm-hmm. so you decided what just to go around. Him. Yeah. How quickly did you know that you were gone? Um, when I got to the secondary. Can't get caught by a safety or not. You were looking around. <laughs> can't get caught by what? By a safety or anything. You were looking around. Were you surprised there was nobody behind you? Um, yeah, really. Because usually it would be someone chasing me still, but yeah, I was surprised. You, uh, are you pretty confident that if you get a breakaway like that, there's not going to be a DB that can catch it? I'm not going to say that because anything can happen, but most likely I'm not going to let anybody catch me. What does this mean for this team? <clears throat> I mean, it means a lot because we've been working so hard and the way we started off. Coach just told us, like, just take it game by game. And, like, the way we was in practice this week, just knew we were going to have a victory tonight. What was that locker room like? Um, it was it was fun. Like, we went crazy in the locker rooms. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What, what was it like? I know you, your quarterback room is pretty close. What was it like seeing Reggie have success right there at the end, get that big first down? Um, it was fun. It, like, it was funny, but at the same time, it was, like, good play. And I wasn't expecting him to beat at the end, like, break off his tackle. And I was, I was excited on the sideline. Yeah. Lamar, what, uh, when you were, especially the first half, I mean, you guys had it really going largely because of your running game. And how, how kind of tough do you feel like that is when, when you guys do have your, uh, especially the quarterback runs, going like you did? Um, well, it's just uh, really like to keep the defense on their toes. And like, if they, make, um, well, basically break in on the run, we just have like quick throws to get up out of this. What, did, what kind of changed in the second half that, that you guys got slowed down a little bit? Um, the weather, like it was like a lot of ball security, and we was running about the ball a lot, so we wasn't trying to get the turnovers. That's what really happened. What's the secret for you to be able to change direction so quickly? Um, a lot of practice. I don't really know. Just you work on that, change yeah. of directions. Mm-hmm. You mentioned about practice this week, about preparing. So did, did you guys sense that you guys practiced the way you need to and that you were ready for today? Yeah, because every Thursday we have a perfect Thursday. And the way I perfect Thursday one, it was pretty good. And the way our energy was from coming off the win with Stan, um, Sanford, just knew we had it. What were the factors that made passing tough today? Like I said before, the weather. Because I wasn't trying to throw the um, ball behind, behind my receivers. And I just wanted to, like, if it was low, it kept slipping out my hand and stuff like that. Anything you learned about like weather games that you may do differently next time, or any any ideas? Well, I gotta keep my hands dry. Cause the ball gonna be wet regardless. I just gotta keep my hands dry. Hopefully, get the ball to the receivers. What'd you see on that touchdown to Pete the corner? Um, it was a linebacker guard him. He's six six. I can't just. I gotta go him. Yeah. You've got five rushing TDs in five games. I mean, did you think when you came in that you could be that effective that quickly? Um, I had to do whatever to get my team to win. That's all I've been doing. Well, that's a lot of rushing TDs, though, for a quarterback. Um, I don't really be worried about that. I just we be trying to score so much. And like if I know if I got a run play, coach told me, just don't get caught, just go with it. Did you ever get caught in high school? Um, that, that's, um, I think I did before. Like once, though. You can't catch me twice. <laughs> <laughs> How do you keep this rolling? How does the team keep it rolling? Um, go about practice. We just got to keep practicing. When we practice and just bring it to the game, our momentum. Just happens. Do you remember which game it was you got caught? Um, no, I don't remember. <laughs> uh, what uh, what did you kind of think about the, the now started Kenny on the offensive line, and Jaron on the offensive line, Lucas on the offensive line, yourself, yeah, Jalen we, Smith? Yeah, we're mean, very young, and like we're still learning. Just he said, yeah, we veterans, because we're still learning from other veterans. We're just doing the best we could. Did, uh, did this change, like, the outlook of the season, you feel like, winning this game? Um, not really, because we still got a lot to make up. Still got big teams to play against. Your first road environment, what was it like? How, how difficult was it to get checks in and calls in? Um, yeah, it was very loud, and that was difficult for me, um, for me in the line to like communicate. A lot. I tried to make a check, they couldn't hear me. They'd be like, "What?" I like try to make my voice a little louder, but just had to do what we had to do. All right. All right, we're done. Thanks a lot.